So, but you know, I'm often referred to as the god of physics by dad. So, yeah. So we have. Can a- we get an opinion that's not from a family member? Are you kidding me? You start with the family. God of physics. God of physics. God of idiocy. He can't even solve a basic reason physics problem. God no. of- Give us an undergraduate understanding why simultaneity, what is simultaneity, why it holds true for Newtonian mechanics, but why it doesn't hold true for the relativity. Newtonian mechanics, time is absolute and does not depend on the reference frame. In relativity, in Einsteinian relativity, time is not absolute and your, the speed of your clock depends on which reference frame you're moving it. What that means is that in Newtonian mechanics, asking if two spatially separated events happened at the same time is a good question. You can say yes or no, and the answer does not depend on your reference frame. But in relativity, the answer to whether two spatially separated events happened at the same time totally depends on your reference frame. It could have happened at the same time, or it could not have happened at the same time. The only way where the answer is a certain yes or no, is if the two events happened at the same point in space. And at that point, the question is obvious. If two events happened a distance away from one another, then Einsteinian relativity tells you you cannot know the answer to whether they happened at the same time because the answer varies by jurisdiction. All right, Rav, you have, of course, one minute. What is simultaneity? Simultaneity is when two things happen at the same time. Now, in Newtonian mechanics, if two things happen at the same time, then everyone agrees they happen at the same time. But this is not true in relativity. Why is it not true in relativity? Because it all depends on the perspective of the reference frame. In one reference frame, two events can happen at the same time. But in a different reference frame, maybe a reference frame moving with respect to the events, it will look like one event happened before or after the other event. So this is called the relativity of simultaneity. And it's one of the famous consequences of relativity. Excellent. Now, Isaac and Rab, they are sitting inside the train. Train is moving 20 meter per second. Isaac and Rab, you know, they are distance by 5 meters. John is sitting in the middle. From John, Isaac is 5 meter to the, uh, to the east, 5 meter to the west. And um, Rab is 5 meter to the east. And train is moving to the east, 20 meter per second, right? Mm-hmm. Draw this, and I'm gonna bring the. And, and John is inside the train, right? John is inside. Stephen is outside. Okay, okay. Correct. Right. Shiva, you have a skill issue. Shut up. Okay. Okay. So John is inside the train. John is inside the train. Stephen is outside. Stephen is outside. Shut up. Yeah, hey, watch it. Thank you. You're welcome. Gotta wait for dad to leave. Shut the. I'm you little. You huh? know when dad watches this recording, he's gonna hear exactly what you said. He's gonna be too sleepy to notice. What? Trust. You're an evil, evil. <laughs> well, who's saying you're not more evil? Can you find the time it takes? Right. Uh, uh, Raf, you're going to find the John perspective and you're going to find mm-hmm. the Stephen perspective. How long and the velocity? How long and velocity? Go. Okay. Okay, wait. Uh, oh, d- uh, John is throwing a red ball to. Oh, Saab is throwing a red ball to John and Raf is throwing a blue ball. No, no, Raf is throwing nothing. John throwing a red, red ball this way? Two meters per second. Red ball at two meters per second, and and, and blue ball two meter per second. Okay. And how long does the ball take to reach ref? And I, I don't have to tell you that. Yeah. No. Like, no, is that what, what we're to supposed find? to figure out? You're gonna have to figure out the velocity. With okay. you're gonna find velocity with respect to uh, Stephen. You're gonna find velocity with respect to John. Go ahead. To John is just two meters per second and minus two meters per second. No. Okay, mm-hmm. and time. Find the time. The time is just 2.5 seconds both ways. Uh, you are doing it for people. You are not doing it for exam. Can you do it nicely? All right. The time that it takes is equivalent to the distance traveled divided by the velocity, if we're assuming that the velocity is constant. So the distance traveled is 5 meters. 
and the velocity is 2. Uh, oh, sorry. I, mm, yeah. And the velocity is 2 meters per second, which implies the time is just 2.5 seconds times meters over meters, which is 2.5 seconds. Is this for, uh, for ref or is this for both? For John, yeah, for both. Because okay. both of them are crossing 5 meters with 2 meters per second velocity. So, simultaneity, uh, simultaneity hold? Yes. So, can you write inside? Inside simultaneity hold? Okay. No nice simultaneity time. hold. Now, Raf, you're going to do outside. Okay. Um, okay, I'm going to do it nicely. So, here's the train moving at 20 meters per second. Here is John. And Already uh, hailed. I'm oh, just kidding. Here is Rev. Here is John. Here is Shiba. And they are five. They are both five meters away from John, right? Yeah. Okay. So five meters. Five meters. And John throws the ball at two meters per second in both directions. So we need to find this, the, the time it takes from Steven's perspective. So outside, Steven, or you can say outside perspective. Or okay. is Steven, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Steven who is outside. So you're gonna first write the velocity. Okay. Steven, yeah. So the velocity of the ball to ref from Steven's perspective is two plus 20. So two meters per second. This guy's a genius, man. Second. And that gives you 22 meters per second. Whereas it was 2 meters per second for John. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Good. Um, and the velocity of Shiba's ball with respect to Steven is uh, in the opposite direction. So this is minus, uh, uh, let's see, minus 2 plus 20. Okay. All right. And can you tell me what that is? Uh, that should be minus 18 meters per second. Let's find the time for ref's ball from Steven's perspective. So this will be 5 meters divided by the velocity of ref's ball from Steven's perspective, 22 meters per second. So 5 divided by 22. Oh, I think ref is a little bit stupid, guys. Ref's a little bit stupid. Yeah. Uh, hey, can I speak? Uh, why? Five, why? Five. Why do you have to speak? What, what, what? Because uh, Ref, being the stupid idiot he is, isn't accounting for Ref's own movement in Stephen's frame. You're moving in Stephen's frame. You can't just do 5 over 22. You have, to write, tw you have to write 22 oh. T equal to 5 plus 20 T. Oh, oh, good, good. Okay, good. Okay. This guy's a real failure, man. Good job. Good job. Hey, can I take over just so the viewers don't okay. get presented with okay, so, mistakes? Okay, so Ref is moving at 20 T. And the ball is, uh, so the ball, okay, no, 20t plus 5. And then the ball is moving at 2t. Not 2t, 22t. You really concern me sometimes, Ref. Okay. 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 That was good. So, two this will t, be... 2t would be John, but this is a Steven. This is Steven, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, Shiba, I'm glad you caught that. Uh, I was checking if you were paying attention. I bet you, I bet you. Okay. I was checking if you are paying attention. It's just admit that you suck, bro. It's not hey, that hard. I have my own formula in special relativity. <laughs> Daddy loves you, baby. Yeah. Okay. Buddy, if you plagiarize something from an obscure researcher and then name it as your own, it doesn't actually become your own. You're the kind of person to see questions on the regions asking, what is the opposite of down flavor? And say, oh my god, they're asking high-level quantum mechanics questions. <laughs> god <laughs> but, damn it. Okay, Re imagine someone who is taking regions physics actually starts to do QFT. This Outs is rap. Outside. This is rap. Time for rap. 2.5. Okay, time for Ref, and okay, time, time for, for now time for Isaac, okay. So, Ref, are you let, sure you're not going to let me, let me be careful here. So, Isaac will be at 20t minus 5, and the ball will be going at 18t. Okay. Yes, that's correct! 
Congratulations, Algebra 1 student. Ah, uh, now he's Algebra oh. 1? Yes. Why don't you... Dumber and Dumber. Why, why don't call it... Wait, like... wait, guys, I still get 2.5. Yes. There you go. Wait, what? Yeah, that... that it's the same distance and the same velocity. You're wait, so... I'm confused now. It's, it's, yeah. I, it's Newtonian mechanics. It's supposed to be the same. Uh, oh, yes, You're yes, so yes, yes. fucking stupid. <laughs> I gotta cry! Don't this cry. is the god of physics, bro? I lose <laughs> faith. The god, the god of physics, I'm an atheist. Oh. <laughs>